Hi there, and welcome back to Icewindel. I'm Baron, and we are still Ready. below uh, the, you know, I'll the real islands and some sort of catacombs. Fighting the undead. Great. But we explored a lot of the level now. Can't be much, you know, much further ahead. No, we can't walk to that spot. What's that? Oh, there's another exit. What's this? Oh, hi. More spirits come to torment my treasonous heart. Be gone, vengeful ghosts. Allow me to endure my shame in peace. We are no ghost, Yolder. We are flesh and blood like you. How can this be? Wolfstein expelled you from the camp. Your quest was over before it began. Why have you come to this place? Wolfstein did more than just expel us. He tried to have us killed. Please. Try not to judge my people so harshly. It was my foolishness that put your lives in danger. It is only right that I remain exiled here until death frees me. Are you saying you've decided to just give up and die here? My fate has been decreed by Wolfdane. An honest man accepts all judgments of his chosen king. You are indeed honest, but my faith has allowed me to see into the heart of your king. Yeah, it's the paladin speaking here. The touch of evil is upon him. I suspect your vision to be true. However, I have already risked too much on visions. If I am to act against my king, I must have proof. Where can we find such proof? If the soul that inhabits Wolfdane's body is indeed corrupt, then perhaps it may have left signs of its passing within the tomb of the dead king. Seek your proof within the barrows of this island. Should you discover anything of importance, return it here to me and we shall discuss our quest further. We found this amulet within Wolfdane's tomb. It appears to have been intentionally defect defaced. This is Wolfdane's tribal insignia. Such chains are worn by the kings of my people and are considered the most precious of worldly possessions. 420,000 XP. So? No true tribesman would dare to deface so sacred an object. If Wolfdane is responsible for this desecration, then it is not the spirit of Jared that now inhabits his body. If not Jared, then who? This I do not know. Even in my visions, the face of the king is obscured, almost as if my vision is opposed. There is one who might help us in our quest. If legend holds true, she may be able to see this soul for what it truly is. Who is this person you speak of? She is known as the Gloomfrost Seer. She was once a powerful channeler of spirits that lived among the tribe of the Elk. The legend says that her gift of sight was so great, it turned her eyes to dust. It is said she fled north to dwell within the darkness of the Gloomfrost. You think this woman can help? The Gloomfrost seer sees many things that are kept from the eyes of mortals. If she still lives, she may be the only help for us now. What exactly is the Gloomfrost? The Gloomfrost lies far to the northeast, beyond the Regged Glacier. It is an ancient place, as old as the world itself. Yeah, that's a weird expression. Every place is as old as the world itself, because it's part of the world. Okay. The tales of my people say that the gloom frost marks the place where the sun was expelled from the womb of Toril when she was still a young mother. It is said that the heat of the infant sun scarred the glacier as it fled to the sky, turning the ice black as night and casting the surrounding land into darkness. Sounds like a cheerful place. <laughs> How do we find it? <laughs> I shall mark the way upon your map. Make haste in your journey, but beware. The guardians of the Gloomfrost protect the seer from the intrusions of man. 
only those who prove themselves worthy shall be granted her wisdom. Yeah, of course, we have to fight our way through, as always. On second thought, I would like to return to Kaldaha first. No, wait, I don't want to return to Kaldaha. Ooh, okay, this is interesting. So I, I, there was actually no need to defeat uh, Bellyfat first. I could have done that part now, now return to Kaldaha. Oh, mm. But then again, the game would end after defeating Bellyfat. Hmm. Okay, but this is actually a way to return to Kaldar. No, I don't want to return to Kaldar now. Very well, we'll make for the Gloom Frost without delay. I shall defy banishment and return to the camp in secret. If you are successful, go directly to the Mead Hall and demand an audience with Wolfdane. Together, we shall expose him and put an end to his evil. Farewell. And he wind walks out of that. Hey, you could have taken us to, uh, I don't know, Lonelywood or anything. But Storm and Gold mod level, that's always a nice thing. 150 hit points. And probably new spells for you. Okay, not much though. But yeah, better than nothing. And oh, he's level 17 paladin now. And she's now a level 20 cleric. <laughs> awesome, I have five heal spells now. Okay. Great. Here. Uh, wait, Storm gained a special ability detect evil. Orders. Who does he have? Smite evil, protection from evil, lay on hands, 21 detect evil, and cure disease. Okay. I'm listening. Well, detect evil is not really useful. I mean, I'll if someone it. attacks you, he's probably evil. And uh, besides from that, you don't really need it. So, well, 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 can we go to that spot it. here? I guess not. Oh, really? A drowned oh, one. This ends this now. Is. How about we fuck you up? See? Mother, I will not dishonor you. Oh, really? Another one of I those. Will clear the field I hope I interrupted your spell. Yep, I did. So, um, I guess we explored everything. Where the hell is the exit? I need an exit. I think here was an exit somewhere. Or not? Here. Here, yes. Oh, you really? <laughs> when I was a child, I did not know the meaning of honor. She's heartbroken again. Goldmond, your saving throw sucks. You have my attention. Storm, set it right. Oh, now she's snapped out yes, of it. Yeah, I'm on it. Get the fuck out of here. Where was it? Here. Okay. I guess we have to go to the ship now. Understood. Still night. What time is it? Five o'clock. <coughs> Hi. Um, can I take us back to Lonely Wood? Yes, let's go.
Got it. So where do we want to go now? still there. Anything new happens? I digs another hole today. Lots of holes lately. Soon as I run out of room. Who was it this time? Other trapper. Dolan. Wolf kills him too. Not much left after wolf eats him, but I digs him a good hole anyway. You truly love your work, don't you? Huh? Yeah, well. Looks like another one of the three stooges bought the farm. Good riddance, I say, but we probably have to do something about that wolf. As long as he's eating stooges, I'm fine with that, but you never know when he starts devouring innocents. So the one stooge should actually remain. You coming? Yes. I guess we can switch back to the morning stop this fauna because we're done fighting the undead. And this one Hi, what do you Got say? It. That bastard. Now Dolan's dead. That simple minded goon went with me down to the lake last night and the wolf killed him. What bastard? What happened? We're sitting there minding our own business when a wolf comes trotting out of the woods and runs right up to us. My brother, that stupid nuthead, he didn't even realize what was happening. He tried to pet it. Moron. It leaps up on Dolan and starts biting his face off. I didn't even know what the hell to do. Next thing I know, Dolan's dead and the thing's coming for me. I reached for my dagger and started stabbing the damn thing, but my blade just kept bouncing off of it. I tell you, the beast weren't natural. I was lucky to get away alive. So you think the wolf was magical? I think Emmerich has been summoning wolves to kill me and my brothers. You know what else I think? I think Emmerich and his little wolfy friend is dead the next time I see them. Mark my words. Okay. Things get complicated now. Let's see what Emmerich has to say to all that. I think he lives down here. I'll handle it. You coming? Yeah, take your sweet time. It's not like we're in a hurry or anything. Where the fuck is he? Understood. Right. Um. Jolly good. I'll handle it. What time is it? Five o'clock. Still. I'm here. Yes, you are. What? Agreed. Get in here. I'll handle it. We should rest. Only the best for us. And now it's... 2 p.m. Let's try again at Emirates. Agreed.
There he Understood. is. Welcome back. Any news about our killer wolf? I talked to Dugal about Dolan's murder. He told us that he witnessed the attack and tried to save his brother, but his daggers had no effect on the beast. Interesting. I heard Dugal went to see Kieran this morning about purchasing an enchanted blade. Do you think Dugal is planning to go after the beast himself? I wouldn't have put it past him. Perhaps you should head over to the Whistling Gallows and ask Kieran if he know what knows what Dugal is up to. Okay. That's, we just came from there. Fine. Head All right. <clears throat> and in again. Understood. Duga can join his brothers in that wolf's belly for all I care. Again, salutations for the wanderers. How may I be of service? Perhaps you could answer a few questions for us. We've heard that Duga was looking to buy an enchanted blade. Do you know why he would want such an item? Ah yes, Dugal. He told me of his encounter with the wolf the other night, when Dolan was killed. He claims the beast was magical and that normal blades would not kill it. I told him I had no such items and sent him on his way. Do you believe the wolf is actually a magical beast? I suppose it is possible. There are many such creatures that cannot be harmed by ordinary steel. Perhaps this wolf that Dugal fought was actually a werewolf. That would explain why his attacks proved ineffective. Thanks for the information. Now with that bit we return to the ranger. How about we look for a werewolf then? I'll handle it. <sighs> and down again. You know, it would be much easier if Kiran and the ranger would actually meet. And, you know, would need us to facilitate the exchange of information between them, but yeah. At least it's not a fetch quest. Done. Uh, we spoke with Kieran about the enchanted blade Dougal purchased. He seems to think that it may be a werewolf that's doing all the killing in town. A werewolf? How can that be? I am certain that the wolf that attacked me is behind these killings, not some cursed man-beast. How do you know the creature that attacked you wasn't a werewolf? I suppose it's possible. It is said such creatures possess the ability to take the shape of both man and beast, but I was wounded in the attack. If the creature was indeed a werewolf, wouldn't it have passed its curse on to me? Perhaps it did. Tell me, what can you recall of the past few nights? By the gods! The nightmares! I've been plagued by the same horrible nightmares every night since the attack. I had thought they were merely dreams sent to me by the forest father to remind me of their transgressions. You and your stupid, t stupid thing with the forest father. It really blinds you. It's madness. Let it go. In the morning I awake drenched in sweat with the bloody images of violence still lingering in my brain. Oh merciful powers, is it true? What have I done? What have I become? Um, we get 420,000 XP for, you know, discovering that Emmerich is a werewolf. Uh, calm yourself. Surely there must be something we can do to help. Help me? I'm a werewolf, a murderer. What makes you think I deserve your help? Please leave me. I need to be alone. Very well. But if you discover a way to remove your curse, we'll be back. And God mod and Tolpan levels. Lots of leveling here. Fine. Level 21 then. Uh, she probably gets new spells. She could get a new... Oh, six levels. Six spells. How nice is that? Wahahaha. <laughs> And Tolpan levels too. Although he doesn't get any spells. Oh, the attack uh, reduced uh, uh, one notch from four to three. That's nice. Ready. Okay, so we need to find something to cure a werewolf. Agreed. Let's ask the mage again.
Hi. All right. It would be much easier if he would come, you know, with us to the ranger. Yeah. Okay. Um, questions. We've discovered that Emmerich has become a werewolf. Do you know of a way to lift the curse? Emmerich, you say? This is terrible news. I'm afraid I do not possess the power to cure such a powerful affliction as maledictive lycanthropy. However, I do have an item that may inhibit the effects of the curse. Take this amulet to Emmerich. As long as he wears it around his neck, he will not undergo the process of transfiguration, nor will he be able to affect others with his contagion. Oh, we'll take, to it, take it to him immediately. Farewell. What do we get? Selunus Karas. This simple amulet has been blessed by the priestess of Selun, goddess of the moon. It has the power to hold the curse of lycanthropy in check, though not cure it. Well, but that's something. Not too far away. Fine. Here. Back. All right. Put it in here. Orders. And out again. And you know, back to the ranger. All right. But I guess that's the final visit, and then we can, you know, start looking for that seer, gloom, frost, seer, whatever thingy. You know. Stay. All right. Uh, Kieran gave us this. M oh wait, he just. Uh, you shouldn't be here. As long as I carry the werewolf's curse, no one is safe around me. I don't want to be responsible for any more deaths. Don't worry, we can deal with werewolves. Kieran gave us this magic amulet. Take it. As long as you wear it, it will prevent you from changing into a werewolf. I don't know what to say. Perhaps now we'll be able to live long enough to atone for my crimes. Thank you. I'm forever in your debt. You're welcome, Marish. Farewell. And we get 420,000 more XP. <laughs> uh, this is the video of the leveling up, I guess. So, yeah. Storm and Zeldana level. I, I think Storm already leveled in this video. Oh, in great sorts now. Two proficiency slots. Awesome. Do you get new spells? No. But Zeldana probably gets new spells. 66 hit points. And um, oh, she gets a level nine spell. What's that? Power world kill. Uh, kill is perhaps the deadliest word of power. It kills on one creature with up to sixty hit points, or multiple creatures with thirty or fewer hit points, up to a maximum of hundred or twenty hit points. The hit points check are done against the creature's current hit point. Okay. So it means if someone has more than 90 hit, 60 hit points, it does not work. Or we could use a summoning. Monster summoning 7. Yeah, I take this one. I'm listening. Good. So I guess that's it. We gave Emmerich the magical amulet that prevents him from changing into werewolf. Perhaps not only would it once again be a safe place at night. Great. <coughs> So we solved right. the werewolf quest. And he got another detect evil. Nobody actually needs that, but yeah. It's the paladin's thing. He has a attack of minus four. <laughs> and if I would take off the shield, it would be even minus six. Yeah, awesome. And Goldmode has a attack of minus two. Tolpan has a attack of. Three and Sedana has a tackle of seven. You have great. my attention. Really great. Let's move on, I say. Doom frost. Gloom frost. Whatever frost. Eighty hours. Oh. That's quite long actually. And here we are. The day took three uh, the journey took three days and eight hours. Alright. We should save now that we're here. Okay, it's a rather peaceful area. Probably won't stay that way. Ah, see, what's that? Snow trolls. 
I have this missed ends you. now. Everybody attack this one, yes. you switch to the Troll Slayer and Understood. kill this one. Thank you. What? The silent blade cuts best. Everybody attack this one. Ready. You switch to the troll slayer and slay. I'll this handle one. it. Here. Easy. So stop. Orders. Troll slayer. Agreed. I'm listening. Mm. That is easy. Where do I have to go? I, okay, it seems, seems there's only one way for me to actually go here. No, there are two ways. Which way? I have no idea. What's that? Frost Salamander. Yeah, oh man, need. it's been a long time since we met those. That's not funny. How do I do it? You have my attention. I'll handle it. You attack this one. Give the word. I yes. suppose I'm you free this to one. do You're your dirty work. Yes. I will clear the field presently. Time to turn this one down to size. Come on. To the butcher. Thanks. So now they're dead. Understood. No, where are you going? You're stupid. I don't get it. What? Got it. Explore that area. What do you want? You. Here. Oh. Ready. All right. So that apparently is a dead end. Stop howling. I'm ready. I know. Here. Understood. What's that? The frozen bodies of two dwarves lie huddled near the snow filled fire pit. Flaming oil. Which way do we go from here? That apparently is another dead end, right? No, it's not. You want a taste of this? Or maybe it is. Just the two frost elementals. <laughs> oh. Fucking cool, the tank. Well, you could have that armor with cold resistance. Yeah, but then again. That little cold attack isn't too bad. Sundered shield. Okay, so I guess I'm listening. We should move to that spot now. That goes in here. Bow 
armor bonus class 2 versus all physical attacks except crushing attacks. This enchanted shield looks like it was punched by a giant. Though to its credit, it has not only managed to stay intact, but also managed to retain some of its original magical protections. Its surface bears the mark was Maker's Mark, Tiernan, and the symbol of a dented helm, though it is hard to tell whether the helm was intended to be dented or whether the impact of the giant's fist marred the symbol. Yeah, but it's just a plus two. Uh, special resistance. Fifty percent. That is good, see? So, but it's time, so we will take a break here and continue in the next video. So thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye.